So, record wasn't in the in the books today, but you still gave a, a good faith effort. What was your thoughts on the race? Um, you know, it's always going to be tough. Race more taking this and one out. going off the record the like that, you got to respect split, it. 35 seconds. Um, shout out to we'll Double to Track Club. A little bit, but that's a Irishman fast defending that record. It's cool to have that kind of uh, representation there, and for us really to be a, be a part of that was a privilege. To be at Penn running a real life professional athlete is a privilege. I mean, I was in Wisconsin and. We, we just pressured Mick at any point to come to this meet and to be able to come here as a pro when you're not sure uh, you get that opportunity again, it's just awesome. And for us to have a crack at it is a really cool thing. And, you know, obviously we had some injuries and some guys that couldn't perform with us on the team and we really appreciate Ben and um, Tom just to take time out of their own uh, schedules and procedures to come here and to run with us and to have Empire. And even the local this is an incredibly club. competitive this field. An amazing, We're wasting uh, no time in this one. Getting off this to a hot start. Can, uh, we can tell the pace is get on. More involved, and we can see some, uh, By the way, the race is strong way. out. Hopefully this one is running uh, in a single file line, conserving energy, keeping off the pace of the person in front of them, letting the wind that, get that that broken. Could be beaten by someone. But make no mistake, they are running fast in this women's 5K. What was in your mind? What was your motivation when you knew you're not really running for a record book, more just running for the win? Because you guys were still together, you know, when you got the baton. Oh, the yeah, and <coughs> he was with me for quite a bit. And I think for me personally, it was just about staying uh, kind of strong and, and relaxed. And, I mean, running on your own out there is tough. And for me, yeah, just being able to close it off, take the win, and, and uh, give those boys some something to celebrate about. Because uh, winning a pen... That's and still Grace Moore of the Union Track so Club out us, front. Yeah, when it came to that, it was about the last the win, split, 77-30. Um, cool kind of Susanna home, Sullivan but, oh, just behind. Were you impressed with Joe Klecker's leg? Closing oh, it? I'm impressed, but I'm not surprised. This guy is an absolute machine, and uh, it was exciting to be able to run a relay with him, and I think particularly leading into the 10K trials for Eugene, he's, he's, pre he's primed, he's ready, he's focused, and... There's an animal in that cage. The front group of six or so runners so starting to break away here. I'm even the front three a bit shorter, starting to just keep this pace consistent and, uh, after that hot yeah, start. Yeah, for his, uh, but really, his opening up this race this, this early on, on pretty awesome. An impressive and, uh, showing from our top yeah, three. I mean, that's I'm Grace just, Moore, Susanna awesome Sullivan, uh, and Elena Hayden. You know, so awesome. Well, thanks for coming out, man. We'll get it next year. There's your extra mission.